I'm going to be showing you how to follow my videos in Firefox. It's pretty simple, just show you side by side, getting to a place and with a bit of touching you guys and figure out, right click inspect on Chrome and on here you have to go to the lines at the top, developer, then go to debugger tool. Now here it gets a bit different. On the left you have some browser things here and you want to click browser-mobile.js that's the important one and then here source and then you go through the steps of files there and then and then once you now you're in the same place in both browsers so are you following now when you click the pretty text the pretty text is just here so click that and wait now click it on the Chrome and they both take a while to load it'll take a bit so now that both have both have loaded you, you'll be good so now you can hit control F on Chrome and type in the bottom that's query dot prototype dot run but you can normally see it there cool now you can just add breaks wherever need be that's in the wrong place <laughs> so now we can go on this side and you hit control F and you have to put the hashtag there and it's case sensitive so query dot prototype uh, I spelled prototype wrong and I, I got a bit confused here and in the end I actually don't spell it right <laughs> so it's a bit embarrassing but I, I managed to find it it's a few lines down Oh, I was real confused here, but um, I'm sorry. I'm not cutting this out. You just going to deal with it. But yeah, so now <laughs> I feel like a retard, but it's okay. Now I'm thinking, okay, here it is. So I click on that. That's lovely, lovely. Now we put the two breaks in the correct places. But we can't do anything yet because in both games, I'm not actually on the right screen to change character. So we both remove both breaks and open character. It's a bit hard when you're small screen. So now I can add the break back. We can add breaks back on both. And this is mainly for if let's say it goes black, doesn't pause when you run it. Then we click equipped, it'll freeze. And same thing happens on on Chrome. It's good. Now that both are frozen, it's right. Now I'm going to make it big so I can show you step by step. It's very simple from here. Now it's frozen, you go to the right side and you click E, object down, and you have to just look down and find the right code line, the object name. But it's a bit hard for me to find it. I don't really use Firefox much. So I'm looking and looking. But right now I'll just show you. And it is very important for you to make sure that make sure that you hit enter you hit enter once you hit enter well I couldn't figure out how to search but it's pretty simple so down here there's the XP so you see that I'm a level I'm level 2 so now at XP you can change it but make sure you hit enter. So you click 9,900,000, whatever. Hit enter every time. Now on the left side, top left side of the script bar, click the little sideways triangle and keep doing it. You have to do it again. So put all the nines in and hit enter again. And then when it's the same, you hit it again and then the screen will move. Good. And now here we go one more time but now you just keep doing it hit enter press the triangle I didn't hit enter hit enter press the triangle lovely now when you press it a few times and it doesn't change you can remove the the break and play and now you'll see I'm level 50 perfect and I'll show you the exact same thing for Chrome just so you have a reference point I don't know what's glitching out at the top Okay, there. So now you open the objects. I'll just put a black line over the top. Go objects. 
and you look for the specific one and it's right there but I've already done max but you, you understand the process always hit enter once you put the values in that's a very important part now I hope it's helped join a discord if you get too stuck and bye